So let me conclude with this. We cannot allow self-doubt to hinder our ability to engage each other or the larger world. The last four years have been hard, but Europe and the United States have to lead with confidence once more, with faith in our capacities, a commitment to our own renewal, with trust in one another, and the ability of Europe and the United States to meet any challenge to secure our futures together. I know we can do this. We've done it before. Just yesterday, after a seven-month, 300-million-mile journey, NASA successfully landed the Perseverance rover on Mars. It's on a mission of exploration, with elements contributed by, contributed by our European partners to seek evidence of the possibility of life beyond our planet and the mysteries of the universe. Over the next few years, Perseus, as we call, but Perseverance, will range and collect samples from the red planet and pile them up so another mission and rover, envisioned as a joint effort between NASA and the European Space Agency, Space Agency will retrieve this trove of scientific wonders and bring it home to all of us. That's what we can do together. If our unbound capacities to carry us to Mars and back don't tell us anything else, they tell us we can meet any challenge we can face on Earth. We have everything we need. And I want you to know the United States will do, we'll do our part. We'll stand with you. We'll fight for our shared values. We'll meet the challenges of this new moment in history. America's back. So let's get together and demonstrate to our great-great-grandchildren when they read about us that democracy, democracy, democracy functions and works, and together, there's nothing we can't do. So let's get working. Thank you all very much.